all that hard work all those hours going into making videos editing producing planning them out like everything could just be gone in an instant hi guys my youtube was hacked recently it was a very scary very depressing experience for me but i've gotten the accounts back now i mean obviously right that's the reason why i haven't posted anything in a while so in this video i'm going to talk about the story of how my youtube got hacked and how i was able to get it back if you are in a similar situation right now like your account was hacked i would like to urge you not to panic because me i panicked a lot you can just skip to this timestamp to see what i did but i want to start by telling the story of how my youtube was hacked you know how i discovered it what i tried to do and how i finally mitigated the situation so here's my story i was walking out at the gym on a saturday morning and this is very important to note because while i was walking out i was watching youtube videos from this madman right here and by virtue of watching youtube videos it means i was signed into my account i was trying to discover new exercises online that i could incorporate into my routine and due to the fact that i was watching so many of these videos in the gym my battery died upon leaving the gym i went home you know took a shower and i left my phone to charge and then i slept for about two hours then upon waking up, the first thing I thought to check was my YouTube, I mean, I really love this platform. And then I discovered that I could not open my YouTube, like it told me that I had been signed out. So I thought, hmm, that's strange. But I didn't think too much of it. I said, okay, maybe Google is doing some kind of backup thing. So I tried signing into my account again, you know, with my email that is associated with the account, putting my password. And then it didn't grant me access and the worst was that he had a side note that said my password my google password was changed about two hours ago so what it meant was somebody had changed my password while i was sleeping at this point my heart rate was through the roof i didn't understand what was happening i was so confused i tried inputting my password multiple times you know but still to no avail you know because i was thinking okay what if maybe it's me that forgot this password? I kept trying it, it didn't work out. So I took the next step. I said, okay, let me try my backup recovery options. I can't go into the details of what they are because obviously <laughs> I don't want my account hacked again. I tried these and they didn't work out. I could not access my own accounts even with my backup options, which at the time I felt that these options were very secure. At this point, I started calling friends and family and i started venting like i was just in a very sad sore state because what this hacker did was really really sinister they hacked into my google account that was linked to my youtube so i was losing multiple things at once i was losing my youtube channel and i was using my main gmail account my main google account so at this point i started thinking to myself this guy has access to my main Google account and it's linked to so many things. This guy could actually gain access to my bank account somehow. He could gain access to other of my social media. So the next thing I started doing was like, I started trying to block everything or change passwords to every other thing that was linked to the account in any way. <laughs> you don't want to be in this kind of situation. If, if you have, you probably understand what I'm talking about because is a real eye opener by your <laughs> so i started checking the internet and you know reading forums checking reddits and i found out that it has happened to a lot of people a lot of the time they were like there was nothing that could be done and they lost their account there was someone that um, told the story of how they had the youtube account 120,000 subscribers or so and they lost the account because the gmail was hacked and the whole comments were like sorry if you tried the password options then there's nothing you could do because the person that hacked my accounts changed all my backup recovery options and they made the main password like backup a hardware key that hardware key without it i could not sign in to my own account. Google really doesn't have like a customer service like that. Like they don't they don't want you contacting them directly. They don't want to, you know, put this feeling out there that 
somebody inside Google can act as a third party to your account. The only ways that you can seek respite is through the forums on Google, you know, which I checked. I didn't see, <laughs> I didn't see any way out. In fact, I saw an information after trying all your backup recovery options, they will tell you that, sorry, you didn't give us enough information to be able to recover your account. So down to how I was able to solve this and get my account back. What actually saved my account, that's my Google account now, was ironically was my YouTube. My YouTube saved my account. Going through all the Reddit forums, I just chanced one comment. Man, God bless whoever posted that <laughs> comment. Try reaching out to Team YouTube on Twitter. Whoever hacked into my account did not have access to my Twitter. So I did reach out to them. I sent them a message. I, Look, my account has been hacked. <laughs> Please help. <laughs> the next thing they asked me to do was to follow them. So they will send me a DM, you know, with instructions and questions, you know, telling me what to do next. So I did that and they directed me somewhere else, you know, to a form where I answered as many questions as I could about what happened to the account. I can't go into too much details about what was on these forms, you know, what I feel, you know, because it's a security risk one and I don't want to compromise the process. But basically what Team YouTube said was they are going to dedicate a team to me, these are their words, you know, to discover what happened and try to recover the account. So they sent me a series of follow-up questions and I filled them to the best of my ability. I also, you know, was in constant contact with them. You know, I filled the form. How do I feel this part is a bit confusing to me. So upon feeling that and giving that to them, they said they are going to investigate the matter. After after a couple of days, like a couple of days, yeah, a couple of days, they checked it out and they discovered that the account was actually hacked and they disabled the account. At that point, like, you know, half of my stress was gone. <laughs> I can't gain access to the account, but neither can the hacker. And they said they were still doing further investigations. So after a while, they now asked me for like a backup email that I can use so that they will send me instructions on how to regain my main account. And I was so happy. Like, I, I just have to give props to Team YouTube. It's so heartwarming to know that, you know, they care about their creators like this. Because at, at that point, I had lost hope. All that hard work, all those hours going into making videos, editing, producing, planning them out. Like everything could just be gone in an instant. Like it's, it's very traumatizing actually. Yeah, so after a couple more follow-up questions, instructions, I was able to gain access to my YouTube account once again. And also my Google account, like my main Google account, they gave me back the access. And it was really amazing. Like even upon giving the access, there are still some follow-up questions they asked and I answered all of them thank them profusely, like thank them very well. <laughs> it's just amazing the kind of challenges that we have in this modern world, you know, mental challenges linked to computers <laughs> that can cause so much distress. I felt like I was in physical pain <laughs> upon losing the account. But ultimately losing the account and getting it back was a learning process for me. And here are some of the things I learned, which I think would benefit you. First of all, you have to take extra steps to secure your accounts. You have to ensure that your password is very strong. You have to like ensure that your backup options too are strong. Upon being hacked, that's the first time I learned about the hardware key. You might want to look into getting that or at least ensure that you have a range of backup options. So if something like this happens, you can still regain access to your account. I also advise like for those that are using on desktop, you have like strong um, antivirus and anti-malware software. I'm not quite sure how it works, but apparently there is malware that can infiltrate your account. It's possible that whoever hacks into my account, like it was not a personal thing. And be careful the kind of links you click on, the kind of uh, websites you visit, hacking, has become a big problem. So you have to take extra steps too. 
protect yourself. And also my final advice is that if eventually you do reach out to Google and um, you know they respond, be as open and truthful as possible about what happened, give as much information as you can, keep a reserve of information about your accounts. Because I can imagine if some of those questions they asked me, if I didn't have answers <laughs> to them, like it's my own account though. When you lose it, you can realize that you know surprisingly little about your own account. <laughs> no stuff about your account. And when the time comes, we are as truthful, as honest as possible. And following my experience, I'm positive that Google and YouTube can help you out. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. This is I'm going back to regularly scheduled programming and trying to post as many videos on as many social issues as possible and i have a new slew of content coming up and i would urge you to like and subscribe and do follow me engage with the content as i continue to provide it thanks so much for watching once again my name is obi king and i'll see you guys in the next one if you are a hacker out there that is hacking into people accounts i have one message for you i'm just joking please don't hack my account again